This is the public access points for the Alpine Trout Farm. We've got three different ponds with different size fish in them. But great for the kids to come down. I mean, it's not on fly here. You'd, you'd use like some, some bait and things like that. But great for mum and the kids. The dad can duck off in the, the fly fishing section and it's a great place to get a lot of fun and a great introduction to fishing. Just walk down. There we go. Ooh. And around the edges here. Yeah. It's probably the ideal spot. Just floating around. So this is just an area, I guess this is ideal, isn't it? So dad can come down here and he can he can practice his his casting and, and his techniques on fly fishing. And mum and the boys can, you know, or, or, and girls certainly can be up there and uh, certainly, yeah. Believe it or not, we should probably get more girls in here fly fishing oh, than guys. Yeah, yeah. So, yeah well, that's, a, yeah. that's a thing, yeah. Yep. Well, we, we do a lot of, uh, like, I suppose, classes on, on fly fishing, and um, I love having girls and, you know, ladies because they'll listen and they'll do it. You know, blokes, when they're learning how to fly fish, think they know it all already. So uh, you're probably right. The girls are much better at it, but. Uh, just a great little spot. I mean, you've still got like a little bit of a flow here as well, so it's going to be very natural, so they can learn uh, the different techniques and things like that as well. And with the, um, a lot of a trout in here, it's natural feed. We don't actually feed yes. them in here. Okay. So it's a mixture, it's just a whole, it's a mixed bag. You don't know what you're going to get. Um, is it going to be large? Is it going to be small? And it's, it's more about people learning the technique rather than anything else. Exactly, yeah. You know, they will catch one here. It gets them interested in it, and then they hit the rivers. Yeah. There we go. There you go. Just a just a little little rainbow there, which are nice and aggressive. So they're good fun, you know. And that's that's what it's all about. It gets that technique going where you can cast, retrieve methods, and uh, even a nice little one like like that rainbow. It's good fun. I mean, you're not going to come here after you've been fly fishing for 20 years and have the best time of your life. But it's not made for that, is it? This is for yeah, that's right. like a learning experience, which is which is, which is is great. So now we do get in. quite a few people that, you know, do do fish the rivers and every now and again said, look, you know, it's not going quite right. And they come down here and they say, this is as close as they can get to the real thing. So, yeah. Because yeah. they're not fed, they're not, there's a bit of flow in there. And, and like you said, it's just about technique. They master the technique. They and usually they'll come and ask a few questions and mind you, you know, these got, a lot of these people have been fishing longer than what I've been alive. Yep. But it's just new things they learn and yeah. You do like lessons as well, Michael, down here? Yeah, we do. Um, and also people that just want to give it a try but haven't even got a rod, we supply rods as well. Okay. So we can really yeah, get out yeah. there and um, you yeah, know, we usually tell them about obviously the area, um, the type of bugs that are on the go at the time, time of year that they're out here and and how to look for them and what to look for in the signs out in the rivers. Yep. So, yeah, no, we do, mate. Well, that's all that, oh, that, that uh, people just need, just that little bit of extra influence or somebody with them to, to, to explain the, uh, you know, I suppose just the basic starter methods and things like that, and they can pick it up from there, can't they? So, well, that's right. Yeah, to have you on hand like ideal to do that, yeah. And that's usually what we do, and um, anyone that comes in and actually, you know, we've got a little store here, anyone that comes in and buys a rod or anything like that, we. We'll get them out for a couple of hours and um, yeah, have a bit of fun and yeah. Oh. What do you got a brown, is it? A brown, is it? Yeah. So there you go, we've got. Uh, Bit of everything in, in, in all the fish we cat. We've got rainbows, nice little brown. Just a, oh, that's your typical river fish, isn't it? That's because uh, they're not fed here. They're quite natural. That's right. So they'll they'll feed. This area is completely catch and release. So as part of the, uh, the setup that they've done there, I'll just drop him back in. Happy as Larry. And it's ideal for, for, for learning and um, it's, it's not a put and take. So you're just catching, learning, putting back in for somebody else to catch. The Alpine Trout Farm not only supplies fish for commercial customers, but also makes fish of various sizes available for private stocking of dams and lakes and for public fishing events. These particular fish are being prepared for delivery to a local private fishery in the custom made transport tank.
kids, get mum and dad to bring you up to the Noogee Trout Farm. And this is what you can grab out of a pond like this. A real feature of this farm is their commitment to producing not only the more commonly known rainbow and brown trout, but also brook, golden trout and Atlantic salmon. So we've just come down through the no admittance area into like a special area, like a holding pond, I guess. Um, and in here, there's quite a few different species. Yeah, no, that's right, Gavin. This is my little private pond. It's um, stocked with rainbows, browns, brooks and golden trout. Okay. So, yeah, enjoy my little backyard. Yeah, sure. Well, it'll be good to even just catch a few of these different trout species and, and some of these we're, we're going to even just cook up and, and taste, you know, because you said there's a lot of different taste between the, the different species. No, there certainly is, and, um, yeah, no, we'll see that. So let's see if you can catch, catch a couple. Catch one first, exactly. That's right. Yep. <laughs> 